Well, I think it really puts us on the map. Um, since 1989, for instance, the city of San Antonio has had a presence in Mexico City, and it's, it's made a world of difference in terms of the exposure that the city of San Antonio has in one of the, one of the world's largest markets. It's been on something we've worked on for the last several years, um, and the reason is simple. Truly, Mexico not only is our largest trading partner, um, but it really is one of the largest markets in the world. It's growing. They just um, have revamped their, their, uh, uh, their system, their constitutional system, so the energy markets are now open. And so you're really going to see some, some major movement in that economy, and Arizona, Phoenix in particular, have to be front and center in that. Larger companies, uh, Fortune 500 companies, have teams that can parachute into a market um, and can do a lot of the research and have the tools necessary to penetrate a market. For a small business, that's a much different proposition, uh, even, if, even if you have 50 or 100 people in your shop. So what this really means for small businesses looking to go into a market like the Mexican market is you have a place where you can go, you have the tools necessary, to begin the dialogue with the people that, that, that are going to help you be successful in your business, the right kind of permitting, the right kind of research, so that when you go down there to start that business, you're going to be successful. Well, I think it's important to really uh, work through the chamber, for instance. We can make sure that you understand the ins and outs of the trade office uh, so that um, when you are ready to go, we'll help you make that connection and we'll make sure that you get the ground running, um, not only here in Phoenix, but also in Mexico City.